To make this piece, the artist created a background using a combination of studio acrylic mediums to build a textured surface. She used studio gloss bindex to add texture to the surface of a Pebio liquid art panel and studio modeling paste to add dimensional effects. She then used Studio Acrylic's red sand texture gel to add a grainy texture to the surface. This medium is also available in yellow, white, and black. After having allowed everything to dry, she moved on to the next step. She began by pouring a coat of Pearl Fantasy Moon Color over the red sand to add a marbled effect to it. She then added a coat of Turquoise Fantasy Prisma and proceeded to tilting the piece of, to manipulate the colors. She then applied a coat of cobalt blue vitrai with a brush and coats of different fantasy moon colors over it. The artist is now adding fantasy moon colors over the blank areas to complete coloring the piece. The artist then proceeds to adding vitrai to the moon colors using a dropper and proceeds once again to tilting the piece. See how the colors self-manipulate and evolved into astonishing contrasting effects of varied textures. Note that this sequence is presented in an accelerated mode in order to help you understand how the paints react with one another. In the making of this piece, you will see Fantasy Moon being used in combination with Studio Acrylic Colors and Vitrai Sound Relief. To begin, the artist spreads Violet Blue and Green Blue Studio Acrylic Dyna Iridescent Color with a brush to create a dynamic textured background. Once dry, she adds some red opaque Vitrai over the Violet Blue Acrylic. It is important to thoroughly stir the paint without shaking prior to use. Now, the fantasy moon part, she adds the carmine moon color with a brush over area of the violet blue part of the piece to create contrasting effects and the turquoise moon color over the green blue acrylic. Notice how fantasy moon creates amazing marbled, hammered, and precious stone effects upon application. Once everything is fully dry, the artist starts drawing outlines of the branches and the pears with a vitrai sound relief in order to eventually add fantasy moon colors in the outlined areas. As you can see, the sound relief is easy to use thanks to its nozzle cap. Note that this product is available in 11 different colors, including black, transparent, transparent glitter, and different shades of gold, imitation lead, and silver. Whenever creating outlines for containing colors, it is important to instruct your customer that they need to create a relief that will be high enough and free of broken edges in order to fully contain the fantasy moon or other colors that will be poured within them. To finish this piece, the artist will introduce a fantastic medium, the Jetio Mirror Effect Metal Leaf. To apply this medium, lines and or patterns must first be drawn using the Jetio Relief Gilding Paste, which really works like sound relief. Once it has become transparent and tacky, the Mirror Effect Metal Leaf can be applied by simply using one finger. This product is available in five different colors. Here, the artist is using silver, gold, and red. The other available colors are blue and green. In these close-ups, you can see how the different mediums used have allowed the artist to create a piece of combination texture, brilliance, and dimensional effects. Now let's move on to the third piece of this webinar created using Fantasy Moon, along with other Pebio mediums, including Jetio Glazing Resin. In this third example, you see the creation of an abstract artwork at first, the artist applies black studio acrylic sand textured gel in a geometric shape on different areas of the surface. In this case, a Pebio liquid art panel. Afterwards, she uses studio acrylic modeling paste to create a textured, dimensional base on certain areas of the surface. To add dimensional relief and texture to the artwork, the artist uses a sound relief from the Vitrai range. To 
To complete this background, the artist will now use Jedio Glazing Resin. This easy to use resin is prepared by simply mixing two parts resin to one part hardener. This mixture must be stirred gently to avoid the creation of bubbles and thoroughly until the mixture becomes completely clear. It can be then dropped onto the surface to create patterns and add dimension. Once all the mediums used to create the background have fully dried, it is time to color the surface. The artist begins by painting areas of the surface with a crimson transparent vitrai color. While the vitrai paint is still wet, the artist adds fantasy moon color into it to create stunning effects. Notice how fantasy moon reacts instantly when poured into a wet vitrai color. In this section, the artist begins by applying the pearl moon color and then applies the vitrai crimson color over it. This allows for obtaining magnificent and unique effects. As demonstrated in this piece, fantasy moon colors generate beautiful, astounding effects whether applied with a brush, a dropper, or even poured directly from the bottle. The effects are immediate and will vary according to the different product combinations being made. Here the effects obtained are achieved by simply pouring moon colors one into the other. Notice that there is no need to mix the colors. They do the work on their own. To finish this piece, the borders of the liquid art panel are painted with black studio acrylic to give it a clean finish and allow the colors to stand out. In this last example, you will witness the creation of a beautiful abstract tree. Again, the artist starts by preparing the background of her piece by applying studio acrylic medium and Jedio glazing resin to add depth to the piece. She starts with a touch of Jedio Glazing Resin applied with a popsicle stick to control the application and then applies Gloss Studio Gel with a spatula for a gloss te textured effect that will become transparent once dry. She also uses Modeling Paste Studio to create dimensional effects on the background of the piece. Studio Acrylic Sand Texture Gel is used for obtaining dimensional, granular effects. To create the tree trunk, she uses Vitrai Transparent Sound Relief. And for the background, once everything is dry, studio acrylic colors. Now let's add some colors to all of this. The artist begins by dropping cobalt blue and deep blue vitrai colors to the piece to create the foliage of the tree. Then she manipulates these colors with a spatula to obtain the desired shape. When done, she adds color to the foliage by using fantasy moon paints. As seen before, it is possible to simply pour fantasy moon colors out of the jar directly onto the piece. The artist here chooses to use a popsicle stick to have control over the moon colors while pouring them over the vitrai colors. A brush can also be used to extend the color or simply apply it. The tool used always depends on the wanted effects. Here you can admire an example of the instantly hammered effect of the fantasy moon colors. See how vivid the colors are when combined with the vitrai colors. To complete this piece, the artist adds studio acrylic colors over the previously painted background and uses the black vitrai sun relief to highlight the tree trunk. For the final touch, she applies silver Jedio mirror effect metal leaf to add ultra shiny effects to the piece over previously applied dry Jedio relief gilding paste. There you have it! 
A beautiful piece with breathtaking effects achieved with a few mediums and colors, a little imagination, and a flick of a brush.